So my name is Nels Tuning and I'm a part of the power group. It's a good afternoon, it's raining now, but uh, not a bad day on the water. We started with very light winds, about three, five knots, then increased to 16 plus. Can you tell us what was happening today and what your objectives were? Uh, yeah, so going out on the water, we knew the forecast was going to be quite windy. So we were prepared to, for the wind to arrive. Uh, we went through some more testing on the new setups we, we changed last week. Um, everything went well and we managed to, to sail, do a couple of bearways, a uh, couple of uh, floating maneuvers and um, hit some good speeds. Um, overall we're really happy um, uh, and yeah, then we had to stop because the wind increased too. Yeah, so what was the uh, top speed you hit today? Uh, we are really fast, I'm not sure, but for sure above 40 knots. And was that upwind, downwind, reach? Uh, probably steady on the downwinds and on the bearways were the top speeds for sure. And you were on the main today, or uh, I was on the the port uh, jib trim. Port jib trim. So, did you have a good feeling for it, or I mean, you went through four different sails. So, what was the difference going through all the different sails? Uh, yeah. So the the breeze increased uh, gradually. So every time we the wind increased, we had to change uh, the, the jib, and then every time we changed the jib, we changed a bit the power of the boat. But uh, more or less, it's similar. And uh, was it a big difference as the wind was increasing and? You have, uh, you know, the M2. So you started on the M2 with very light wind, and then you know, it started to come up very strong. Uh, you know, how, how does that impact? How does it impact the, the performance of the boat? Uh, I think generally the boat feels uh, a bit more light. Like the, the, if we have, or if we're overpowered, everything feels heavier for sure on the helm. It's a big difference. Um, so yeah, it's just to make the boat, the boat more controllable. Uh, so uh, re reducing the sail area makes the, the boat faster and also. Uh, more controllable. So you had a pretty big touchdown at the end, was this the end of the session or any damage from that? Uh, yeah, so like I said, the, the, the winch uh, climbed quite a bit, so we were hitting the upper range there. Um, and, and yeah, the boat uh, was not reacting the way we wanted, so we just took it uh, safe and uh, decided to call it a day. And you have big wind tomorrow, are you going to be sailing tomorrow? Uh, we still have to look into the forecast for tomorrow, so hopefully we can sail. Uh, we try to get as many hours as possible on the boat, so the forecast is nice, for sure we'll try and give it a go. So you have a new uh, main sheet system. Now you're going to start putting some miles on, getting some data. Do you feel any difference with the new main sheet system? Uh, for sure, I I'm not directly trimming the, the main sail, but for sure the, the sail looks much better with the new system, so uh, hopefully we can get some more uh, positive data out of that. Perfect. Thank you very much. Thank you.